Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I'm Nicole Chantel and if you like beauty videos, 31 days of Halloween and Friday vlogs, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button and become a part of my makeup family. With all that being said, let's jump right into this video. So hello my loves. Today is a new product video. I don't know how long this has been out on the market for, so it's new to me. I did stumble upon it into my local Shoppers Drug Mart. I was like, hello, Rima London. What is that you have there? So I did pick up three shades of the Lip Art Graphics, and this is the Liner Plus Liquid Lipstick. So I did get three shades here, and they do have a total of nine on their website, but into my local shoppers, there was a total of six, so they did not have the full range there. But out of all the shades that were there, these three here screamed the loudest to me. Like, I was like, okay, I'm in love with those colors. They were brand new, just put out, not even swatched. I was so happy. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go ahead go on to Rema London's website and give you all the details about these products, show you swatches, and give you my final thoughts at the end of this video. So on Rema London's website, it says a self-expression lip art. Draw inside the lines or create your own lip art. Smooth and light weighted formula allows you to perfectly create desired lip look. Ultra precise applicator, multi-use liner and liquid lipstick, cream velvety texture, ultra light, comfortable, silky satin finish. Now these did retail for 949 Canadian dollars. So there you go, there are all the swatches. What are my final thoughts on the Rimmel London Lip Art Graphic Liner and Liquid Lipstick? I will have to say I really enjoy these products. I think the applicator is definitely precise. It definitely lined my lips so beautiful that I went ahead and I filled them in and I let it dry down. It took like a minute to two minutes for it to dry down fully and then I went in with a second coat. So each application was two coats on top, two coats on bottom and I have to say that they did not bleed at all whatsoever. I find them to be super comfortable on the lips and really pigmented. This shade here, this pink shade, which is called Own Your Power. I absolutely love it. This is definitely going to be a go-to color shade for me for the rest of the summer because it's so vibrant and so beautiful. And I think that it just pairs up with this like simple, gorgeous 
I look so well. All the colors did actually, but this one here I really truly love. And I hope that my local shoppers do come out with the rest of the line because I would really be interested in trying them to see how well they work. Now for the rest of the claims when they say creamy, velvety texture. I will have to say that yes, at first, when you first apply them, they are definitely creamy. You do feel that like velvety texture on your lips and they're very nice and soft and smooth. As for the ultra lightweighted, comfortable, silky satin finish, it is definitely ultra lightweighted. That is for sure. I do find it comfortable. Do I find it to be a silky satiny finish? Definitely not. I find that when you first apply it, yes, it looks like that, but then it dries down. And to me, it's like a very beautiful light matte finish. I don't find anything like that satiny silky finish. In the center of my lips though, it does feel like it's silky, but then the rest of it feels like a very light matte liquid lipstick, like not a full on drying matte liquid lipstick. I will have to say they're a little tiny bit drying, but not like fully drying. They are super comfortable. And the other day I did wear this shade all day long, Own Your Power, and I have to say that it did not budge, it stayed in place. And even when I was swatching these on my lips for you guys, when I was removing them with my makeup wipes, they did not want to go anywhere. They like, they literally wanted to stay there. They did not want to budge. So each application I had to go in and apply some concealer and foundation just because like there was a little bit of product left over that I just could not get off. So that is good to know that they do stay in place. As for lip art, I mean, yeah, I could totally see you using these for lip art because the applicator is so nice and small and precise and it just applies the product so easily. All in all, I'm really impressed with these products. I think that Rimmel London did a fantastic job on these. Let me know in the comments down below if you have any of the Rimmel London Lip Art Graphics Liner and Liquid Lipsticks. Let me know if you try them out. What do you think of them? Do you love them? Do you hate them? And also let me know in the comments down below what is your favorite Rimmel London product. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.